Okay, here we go, Miss Pac-Man. I'm gonna review. Every, I'm gonna do a playthrough review of every single version of it that's that I have. Pretty much every generation of it. Watch the introduction. This is the arcade introduction. And my gameplay price is not on Trotter. I'm going to show the game off. And there's actually a guy on YouTube that basically he puts every cheat code where he doesn't get killed on. Claiming he's showing me. No. No. Part of it is showing your skills. My goal is simple. All I want to do is, is get to level three. All I want to do is get the orange level. That's what I'm talking about. I'm not playing this one, I'm just playing to beat the level. There you go. Upset about that heck with it. I already accomplished everything I set up doing this. Score the boot. That's nice too. But that wasn't my number one priority in this. You're playing playing this game with your offhand. Sometimes you get some hairy little situations that you don't expect to get. Oh well. It'd be nice to get the seven card turn. But didn't have it. Okay, that's all of Miss Pac-Man on the arcade. I'm playing my modded Xbox. Now, that was good. Now, how about some bad? Yeah, we're going to do bad, bad, bad here. Oof. This is going to be rough.
This is going to be rough. It's not going to be as bad as the NES Pac I mean, as the Atari 2600 Pac Man was, but it's still going to be pretty bad. kill the game off and redo it. Because there's supposed to be four monsters, where the heck are the other three? Complete one board. Okay, that's that's all in this pack. 
I don't know what the deal with that, that other thing was, but you know what? No biggie. It was a minor inconvenience. Okay, unfortunately, we don't have Miss Pac-Man on the Atari 5200. So, we'll move on to the Atari 7800. But to make up for it, Tin Game released both an authorized and an unauthorized Miss Pac-Man for the NES, so that will make up for it. And yes, I will show both of them, if, if it's possible. I don't care about this. I don't care about that. Okay, there we go. No, it's, it's a little bit better. Oops. I'm embarrassed. Whatever will I do? Play a second game if I have to. That at least beat the board. I'm not even worried about the chair. The disadvantage of being about a right-handed person trying to play this game, seeing how the controller is set up for the left. It's definitely coming into play right now, but you know what? I'm not going to gripe about it. It's like I've got that cartoon guarantee, which is, which is my goal. It's not bad, believe it or not. This is not a, this is not a bad rendition of on me. But that's okay. I did the barest minimum I got. Got, that got what I wanted, which was that taken care of. Now we move on to the Nintendo. And I have a check Nintendo 64. So I don't know if Nintendo 64 has one or not. See, we have the ten again. We have the official. Let's look at the official one first. Oh God, that's awful. What was Atari thinking with this?
want to do is complete the board. I don't care about beating the high school. I'm not caring about that. All I want to do is get to that first cartoon. That looks better marginally. It doesn't sound as bad as the Atari 2600. It doesn't look that bad, but still, ugh. What were you thinking? Thank <laughs> you. 